Salute blockchain lovers, I'm alive with Crypt Story channel and today we need to discuss another platform which was appeared and called Astra, the social supercomputer, AI powered social computing platform. So guys, let's try to recognize what is it and how this platform can be useful in our everyday life. And uh, let's start. Actually guys, it's kind of a collaboration of users from around the globe. I mean the collaboration of their devices, collaboration of their computing power. So it is uh, the main thing in this area, the main purpose to collaborate the computing power of different de devices from around the globe and to use it. And they offer us to use it in two different ways. So the first way is to use this computer powered for scientific discoveries and um, the next thing is to use this computer in power for mining cryptocurrencies and because of the latest trends i think all of you understand that most of the people will uh, use it for mining cryptocurrencies and it, it's a fact guys but maybe our scientists our brilliant and intelligent brains will do something really outstanding who knows and here guys you can find two markets as i have said before the first medical and scientific market and the second is ai driving social mining so let's start one by one and here guys they wrote a list of possible doings so the first sector is about medical discoveries so scientists can use this computer power to prevent such diseases like cancer, HIV, malaria, Alzheimer's and so on. And actually guys, I think that it, it's really necessary because nowadays a lot of people suffer from these diseases and we definitely should eradicate this phenomenon, this ugly phenomenon, this disease from our planet, from our people. And I think that in this case, this platform is really useful, of course. Because, for example, in a lot of medical institutions, there is no computing power at all, no technologies. And I think this platform will be very useful for them. Another sector is about global warming. So the scientists can calculate different scenarios of our climate conditions and so on. The third sector is about clean energy, but there are a lot of investigations in this area and uh, I think will be necessary for this sector. But anyway, it can be possible. The next thing is subatomic world. And um, for example, they wrote here the statement about large hadron collider. And actually, guys, if you know something about this machine, you know that it's a total scam, the biggest scam of the 21st century. The guys here are doing nothing at all. They only discovered microwave beams or microwave arrays. I don't know how to describe it correctly. And um, the next thing is microwave oven. And that is all, guys. They are doing nothing at all here for the several years. They are making here different simulations of strange things which were never happened and which will never happen. If you know something about periodic table, I mean the history of it, I think you know that the first element was not hydrogen, the first element was a fear. And this element jeopardized the whole theory of Einstein and that is why I can't agree with this statement because it's a total bullshit. But of course it is in my personal opinion guys, because I'm fully disagree with the large hadron collider i mean with his activity because it's a total scam but the other things are very attractive guys like universe because it's extremely important to discover the universe but what is more extremely important is to discover our oceans and our seas because ocean is only five percent discovered only five percent guys just imagine only five percent and of course scientists said that our cosmos is one percent discovered but actually it's wrong it's not discovered at all and of course in this way we can use this computing power to discover our oceans and our universe and 
the last sector is about economic models and I think it's all clear in this area. Now let's go on. Here guys there is a second target market AI driving social mining and I think this paragraph would be very interesting for you because in collaboration I mean if we collaborate all the computing power of our devices we can mine perfectly. But what about energy bills? It would be interesting to see the comparison. Will it be cheaper or not? So another fact is about universal identity. They want to make digital identity for all citizens on the world. And it's interesting to see how they will do it alive. And some other things you can find here like authenticated credentials, asset registries, transparent governance and product provenance. I fully vote for these two sectors like product provenance and transparent governance. But actually, for example, in Russia, <laughs> I can't imagine that our country will be corruption free because, for example, in our country, we must hand this, <laughs> hand this corruption guys like in China and in the other way it will not work. But actually, I really want to see this in our country. So let's go on, guys. Now I want to show you the information about the tokens. This information you can find on the front page of their website or in the white paper. So here we go. The primary token inside this platform is Star Token. Actually, I like this name. And one Ethereum during the pre-sale costs for about 2000 Stars Tokens. And the other price changing you can find here and some information about the bonuses. And here guys you can find the information about the main token sale. So during the main token sale one Ethereum approximately costs 1000 star tokens. An accepted currency now is only Ethereum. Please pay attention to this guys. And you will have for about only 15% of estimated tokens which would be ready for the sale. It's really a small amount. <laughs> Maybe because they want to control this um, decentralized application by having uh, big amounts of these tokens. But okay, we will see in the future how this platform will operate. And as usual guys, you can find a lot more information listed in the social networks and in the social media. I just want to show you their interface so it will be looking like this and of course this platform provides you dApps like mobile dApp and uh, web dApp and so on. And guys, if this video was useful for you, please subscribe on our channel and give us a thumbs up. Now this is all for now. Have a nice day.